hello guys and welcome back so now in this video we will add the animation for the punching if you play the game you will notice that we can walk we can also run we can also jump but when we try to press the mouse left key as you can see we can't punch so let's add the punching animation so open up the script which is rifle pickup and right here inside this rifle assign things after the radius let's add a reference to the animator so public animator let's name this as animator as well so save it now let's assign the animator to it right here and the animator will be the same uh, which is uh, added to the player so we can actually drag and drop the player and as you can see it automatically choose the animator from the player game object and as you know that we have added all of the animation on the single animator we have the cross punch animation right there and this is the parameter for the punch so right here in here when we press the mouse left button then what we want to do we will say animator dot set bool and we will set the punch to true and then when we are punching of course we want the idle to be false so we will say animator dot set bool idle and set the idle to false that's it and then in the else block when we are not punching or when we are done punching then what we want to do we want the vice versa of what we did right here so we will set the punch to false and the idle to true so set the R2 true and that's it let's save the script now let's play the game okay let's first uh, bring the animator down below and uh, you will notice that when we press the fire one button as you can see it plays the punch animation as you can see now as you can see it is playing the running animation let's get closer to this okay and let's punch this as you can see it plays the punch animation really beautifully so let's end this video right here in the next video we will add all of the remaining animations for the shooting